everyone and welcome back on my channel today with Burberry weekend for her Eau de Parfum I do have here a 3.4 floor ounces bottle with 100 ml and unfortunately I lost the cap or I didn't have it I don't remember I'm gonna also put a picture with the bottle and the cap on top so you know how it actually looks like with the cap on top per my understanding the packaging of this fragrance also was also changed i'm not sure about the reformulation however i'm going to also insert a picture with the new packaging now this fragrance was introduced in 1997 and the nose behind it is natalie lorson among the notes we have mignonette mandarin orange sage nectarine blue hyacinth peach blossom rose hip iris red cyclamen, violet root, musk, sandalwood, and cedar. Now this fragrance to me starts very fresh, very refreshing. The hyacinth note is very prominent, so it has this sweetness to it, but it's not the syrupy sweetness. It's more like the hyacinth sweetness. It is also a little bit of powdery. A little powdery but not too powdery so it's not overwhelming powdery it dries down in a very aromatic woody sandalwood mixed with musk like fragrance but also the hyacinth is again very prominent and it is a refreshing fragrance it's not a sweet fragrance to me this fragrance is more like a relaxation inducing fragrance i can picture a hammock between two trees in a huge backyard or a huge garden and me relaxing in it when i wear this fragrance so if you are interested in fragrances that change your mood or you want to relax this is probably the right fragrance to use now it also is very affordable it starts at about $15 and the lasting power is pretty good around eight nine hours on my skin this was Burberry weekend for her Eau de Parfum thank you very much for watching until next time